What's going on everyone? We've got an important topic to talk about today. So we're just going to hop straight into it today. Remember, I'm not a financial advisor, none of this financial advice, but let's talk about it because this is very important. And I know you all seen the thumbnail for today. I know you all seen the title and the title for today's video is the Baby Doge Army is waking up. Baby Doge holders, they're waking up. So this is a post that was actually made by the Baby Doge team, the Baby Doge developers. And my previous video, I talked about how they need to talk to the people more because, you know, all they're really doing are marketing posts. Remember, they used to actually talk to people in the post. But all they're really doing are marketing posts, talking about their NFTs, talking about Baby Doge AI, talking about stuff like that, right? Um, talking about the next wave of Web3. They got all their merch. You know, they're, they're pretty much promoting themselves in every single post, but not necessarily talking to the people, just promoting themselves and, you know, talking about, you know, the uh, different donations that they're doing with like the Rough Haven and stuff. But they're all just Baby Doge promos. And, uh, you know, little updates here and there about getting listed to different exchanges and DeFi exchanges, all that good stuff, right? You know, normal crypto project stuff, right? Normal crypto project stuff. But this post right here, after they promoted themselves, they did ask the community a question. So shout out to them for that. They said, making memes to burn coins. What's a be better utility for a meme coin? But see, the problem is, is that they weren't necessarily talking to the people, Right. It's almost like they're talking for the people because it says making means to burn coins. What's a better utility for a meme coin? Exclamation point, question mark. But see, when you put exclamation point, question mark, that's not really you asking a question. That's really you emphasizing a question, but already having your own answer. So that's one thing. But what they got was an answer from the community that I'm definitely happy that people are asking. People are finally asking the real questions, you know, people are still talking about burns. Like I said, burns don't matter. Burns really don't matter. We want maximum supply reduced. Burns don't matter. But people are really waking up. This person says, hello. This shout out to this person, by the way, Medi. He says, hello, please reduce the transfer fee on the BNB blockchain. It is too high. And by the way, this had 19 views so far. It says it is too high. 10% is deducted when transferring from the exchange to the wallet, which is true. And 20% is deducted when transferring from the wallet to the exchange, which is too, true because first it's 10% when you send it off, then you send it back, it's another 10%. That's 20%. So we already know if it's not your keys, it's not your crypto. In general, in crypto, we want to have all of our crypto on our wallets. So in order to do that, we're buying from the exchange, we're sending it to our wallet, we're losing 10%. When we're selling, we're sending it back to the exchange, we're losing another 10%. So this is a huge problem, right? now. Let's keep going on with this. So they said, and 20% is deducted when transferring from the wallet to the exchange. This is too much and has nothing for the hold. So this is this is 100% true. It's way, way, way too much. There are way too much taxes. The Baby Doge Army is waking up, which is good. They're asking the right questions now because, you know, all these burns and stuff like that doesn't matter. What really matters is stuff like this. So... I think this is a good post. I'm going to go ahead and retweet this because, you know, this is this is a good post. Everybody needs to know about this. Everybody needs to be talking about this inside of the comments and everything, right? If you're not talking about it, they're not going to listen. So if everybody's talking about it, eventually they're going to have to listen. And if they're not able to change the smart contract so then we can take off the taxes, well, then we're going to have to migrate to a new contract because, and yeah, migration does hurt projects. But there's other projects that prevail from these migrations, you know. So there's there's projects that have been came that became successful from migrating. So me personally, if we migrate, I think we should migrate, but we should do it with a thought of let's make Solana our new blockchain. Like I was make like I was talking about in our other video. Like that would be cool if we could make Solana our new blockchain and just migrate there. But if not, then we could migrate to just uh, another BNB smart contract. But you know, like I said before, like migrating, it could hurt the project though. So if they can change the smart contract so that we have no more taxes, then that will be good. You know, there's other people talking about things here. You know, people still talking about, you know, burns and stuff like this person says burn baby doge is the best solution. Burning does nothing. Burning does nothing. I'm just going to have to keep saying that because people don't listen. Big token burning does nothing. Come on, burn 99%. But the people are holding over 99%. <laughs> this is, 
it doesn't make sense because you know people are holding most of the coins so unless they um make something in the smart contract where they can steal everyone's coins and burn them then they could never burn 99 percent, and that would never happen so yeah the burns don't matter there's still a bunch of people talking about burns but i had to give that one person a shout out because he's asking the real question he's asking the real question no one else is asking the real question just this one person so shout out to him um everybody go support him you know he doesn't really uh post on twitter here it's like a he was here since 2021 but never post anything but yeah shout out to this person though shout out to this person because they're really asking the right questions here so when are we going to get it because that's this is what we need we need 10 percent reduced if we don't get 10 percent reduced then you know what are we even doing here because like 20 20 percent that's way too much but yeah let me know what you guys think about this this was just a little short video talking about that but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, hit the like button and subscribe. And as always, I'll be back with another video.